Welcome back to Ghost of a Tale. We're currently trying to help out Doinlin find the name of, I think it's their lover, because I can't remember it. And with that, we might be able to help them remember enough to help us find the rest of what we need, find the other mouse that stole the rest of the stuff at Doinlin's grave, or tombstone, or whatever it's called, to help out Silas. Welcome, good mouse. Were we not once acquainted long ago? Uh, not so long ago. But I sense you come in search of answers. My lady, I think I have a name you bid me find. I do? A name? The name of the one you loved. Then pray speak it. Oh well. There's a lot of names. <laughs> Um, I think I should go back and look at the inscriptions. If I can, though, the thing is, after lighting all of them, I think I made it so that you can't look at the inscriptions anymore. I thought it was just the one by the bee's nest that you couldn't read, but I think after lighting them all, I don't think you can read any of them. Like, let's just test it right now. Oof. You okay, little mousy? Like, can we read this one? Oh, hi. Oh, God. Yeah. I, I can't read them. Huh. I guess I did this quest too early and it's not meant to be done like that. And I guess I kind of broke it. So I don't think I have any choice but to just guess at the name. That sucks. Let's go ahead and save it first. I'm assuming getting the name wrong is probably going to lower my renown that I get for doing this part. Hmm. Do I have even, like, an educated guess? I know that Yarlin was at the battle. Could it be them? Maybe Yarlin? This was my true love's name? Yes? Nay. It was a fellow warrior, perhaps the best of us, and a good friend. But my true love? Never. Ule? Take all the time you need, good mouse. <laughs> okay. Roderick. Mm-hmm. Tis a name I have heard not so long ago. But my love? Nay. Kenlin? Impossible. I have no love for that oaf. Hythe? By all means. Oh, this is not going well. Yoth? Huh. That's strange. Some of the options disappeared after I mentioned them, but some of them are still here. Why? Hmm. So, I just can't do this right now. That's odd. I don't... I don't understand. I hope I didn't completely break this quest. I can't read any of the inscriptions. Well, I really don't know what to do in the forest. I don't know if I just completely broke that quest or if I need to do something else. So in the meantime, I'm just going to head to the harbor, progress with some quests down here. Maybe the blacksmith can give me a hint or something. Uh, I don't know. Hopefully it'll all work out. Got plenty to do in the meantime. Gotta remember to look at each new guard and see if they have something on their belt. Other than a handkerchief, because that's not worth very much. But a key or anything like that. Now I'm super suspicious about any of these rings that they can be turned and used to open a secret passage. I do want that handkerchief, though. Uh, I don't know if I'm, like, slightly faster than them or at the same speed or what. Am I gaining ground? Got it. 
Whoa, what's that? It's so cool. Massive gem crabs. Hey there. Gold nugget. Right here, buddy. <laughs> Look at those stocky little eyes. Mmm. My water looked very brothy. Elevator gate key. I don't think so. Wait, can you really not climb up that? The heck? But it's so climbable. I know I'm supposed to come to the harbor to speak with the blacksmith. They're supposed to meet me here. And that guard over there doesn't have a key. Hmm. There's got. Oh. There's got to be a way over. Oh, God. I didn't think they could pathfind over to me. But, uh, life, uh, found a way. Hmm. I don't think this goes anywhere. I feel like I'm definitely supposed to be here. And you really don't have a key. Wow, you forgot about me. Haha, <laughs> I did it! I don't know if you're supposed to do that. It seems like you weren't, although it looks like you're supposed to. Like, visually, it looks like you're supposed to climb over that. It's so obviously climbable. But then you can't, so I don't know. Anyway, uh, we did it. I feel like I'm really breaking the game now. Am I? I don't know. I don't know what else to do, given that I don't know how to progress in the forest. Just want to find that key now. up here anything or is it just a way back over hmm it's so cute when they fall on their butt So many climbable things in this area. Ooh, yeah, I'm completely out of oil. Hello there. Oh, look at that massive fish on the wall.
Should probably save now that I'm on the other side. Ooh, key. Elevator gate key, yes. Okay, well, if the key's on the other side, then maybe you are supposed to go over. It's just weird that it was so funky to get over. I think that might be a map of the harbor. Yeah, nice. Can't read that? Nope. Whoa. What the hell? I'm glad I switched over really fast. Hi. Was that a time thing? It just became like, I don't know, 1 p.m. or something? If you look in the bottom right. I, I guess they're set to come over at a certain time, and I just happened to be in them when they came over. <gasps> that was awkward. Pirate's boots. Dang, look at those things. Just need a silk sash and belt. Yeah, I guess if there's any place we're going to find pirate parts, it'll probably be at the harbor. Coastal status report. Well, the last status report wasn't very interesting, but I'll just briefly look it over. Oh. Oh, that's what I had before the coastal status report. It's a copy of it. Now I've got two of them. Okay. Okay. Guess we shall speak with them. I don't know if we have anything to talk to them about. Oh, I think we need to report the three guards that we found to the commander. Uh, the smiters, sir. It was an ambush. You weren't assigned to the squad, Private. What were you doing there? The signal guard, sir, he asked me to take his place. I see. I shall have words with signal master Wagstaff. The squad leader's in the infirmary. By all accounts, it was you that saved his life. Bravo, indeed. We don't yet know what's become of the others. The rest of the squad, they're dead. I have their opals. May I see them? Kith. Battle. Scarf. I appreciate you bringing these to me, Scow. It's a pity you couldn't help them more. Now, I'm grateful, Scow, for your assistance in this matter. I'd like to do something for you in return. What did you have in mind, sir? Well, let's see now. Your armor, Scow. It's rather ill-fitting, isn't it? I mean, look at you. You can barely walk in it. I can have the smithy make some adjustments, if you like. Shave off some weight. Cut down the folds, retailer the greaves, so you can move more freely. Oh, and I should have him brief you about the traps, given all the problems we're having with spiders. But one thing at a time, huh? Now. Commander takes a sheet of paper and his quill pen, beginning to write. After signing his name, he folds the paper into thirds and seals it with wax before passing it to you. Take this to the smithy. You'll know what to do with it. Nice! So I'm going to be able to move faster? That is going to be so nice. I wonder if I can even sprint. Dare I dream? Hmm. Anything I can do for you, Commander? Play for me, Scal. Play anything. Surprise me. <laughs> I could play that same song about hating rats and how they should be killed. Um, hmm. Let's not do that one. Let's do... Heaven in a Bottle.
I liked your choice of songs, Gal. Have you ever thought about singing professionally, Scow? On occasion, sir. Don't. <laughs> okay. Thanks. Anything I can do for you? Play for me. Oh. Uh, perhaps later, sir. Of course, yes, I should get on. Let's see, where shall we go from here? Where the heck did I come from? I know it wasn't from over here, because I need to burn this. Oh, I can't burn it. Too risky. Hmm. If I switch fast enough... Yeah! Everything's fine. Ooh. Why is this taking me? I'm wondering where the smithy would be, because it, like, I was under the impression from our conversation that they just left and were going to be by the shore, but maybe they're still there? I don't know. Because I'd really like to upgrade my armor as soon as possible so I can move faster. That would allow me to get so much more done. Let's go up here. Where does this go? There's so many places. Up, up, and more up. Okay, well, I think first thing I want to do is try to upgrade my armor. I just want to check, though. I do have a quest to meet them, to meet, um, the smithy at, like, the shore, right? Meet the blacksmith on the cliffs. I mean, that could be anywhere in here. Oh, what the heck, let's just go, let's just keep going. PM, that's fine. Catacombs key. Wait, what exactly is that for? I mean, I've already been to the catacombs, no? What needed a catacombs key? Hmm. Oh, I love little places like this where there's like a... I don't know what you call it, but like a rift in the rock. Like a little... I guess it's like a really tall cave, sort of? And it's just something I associate totally with pirates. Like a pirate's cove? Oh, maybe that's what it's called, a cove. Is there something really cool about it? I don't know what it is. Oh. Catacombs key. Where's, where exactly is that going to lead? Is that going to loop back to somewhere I've been? I'm curious. Back in the catacombs. I don't remember that door. Doinland's urn. Have I been here before? This is vaguely seeming familiar. Yeah, I've definitely been here. Hmm. Okay, cool. Got another shortcut. 
So we just found the shortcut through that door. So let's go this way. See what's over here. I'm trying to see if there's like places I can drop down. I could totally survive a drop down to there, but I don't know if that leads anywhere. Hmm. Something to consider at some point. Love the bitter batter. Look at how high up we are. Ooh, there's stuff there. Right there. It's like a bottle of rot gut and a body. Hmm. Could just jump down there, but there's probably a better way. Maybe this leads to it. Whoa, where's this? Still says we're in the catacombs? What the heck? This is definitely not the catacombs. Oh, wait a minute. Are we inside the tower? No, we're not. The the far tower. We're, I don't think so. But it looks like there's an obelisk right there. Maybe the fifth one that I thought was maybe missing. Oh, there's even another one over there. There's a bunch of them. This place is so huge and I don't even know what this place is. No name popped up when I came out. Ooh. Are these the same mushroom types as we're over in the rest of the forest? If so, then I'm definitely going to find the last one that I need. Look at this view. 5 p.m. so the sun will be setting pretty soon. Haroth, incorruptible. The emerald flame could not assail him. So we're supposed to look for the name that's associated with the inscription that looks like the, uh... The... I forgot what the thing's called. You know, the thing. Clarion? The Clarion or something? So those I can also burn in the right order. I wonder if they're totally separate from the other ones that I burned. Or if they're connected somehow. I'd be surprised if they're connected. They seem so far away from each other. Cat's Tooth. Yeah, definitely the same types. So it's around like uh, fallen wood, like tree stumps and stuff that I should find the one that I want. I feel so uncomfortable, like I've left so much stuff unexplored. I feel like I've traveled too far. I'm nervous. So I'm like constantly indecisive with where I'm going. I'm like, where have I been? Where am I going? Where have I been? I'm losing track because there's too many places. I can go that way, I can go this way. Ooh, I think this might be the one we need. Ear cap! There we go. Got them all. However, I'm not in any great hurry to return that because the one that was supposed to be harder only gave me like, I think, a hundred renown or something, so I'm guessing this one isn't going to give me anything better than that. Sildrot. A wit as sharp as any sword. The inscription looks the same as the other one. Like, in terms of the design on it. It's probably not really much of a point in collecting more mushrooms. <laughs> Where am I going? 
What is this? Where does that go? This place is uncomfortably large. Sure. Okay, the blacksmith should be here. Even this has a multitude of pathways. Ranger's belt. Shore map. Nice. Need hood and boots. This place is pretty large. I'm in too deep. <laughs> I'm 20 layers too deep, it feels like. Little alcove here. Look at how red the ears are when there's light being shined on them. Pink little mousy ears. Oh, this is off the map now. Back to the harbor. Okay, okay. So they link up. Good, I kind of wanted to go back to here anyway. I was going to switch armor, but I couldn't do it fast enough. But then again... Do I really want to explore here when I've got the slow armor? I really want to talk to the blacksmith and get the faster armor. I'm going to go back to the shore. That's my final decision. I'm going back to the shore and I'm going to not try to explore it thoroughly. I'm just going to try to get the armor. And then I'll feel a lot better about exploring. That's not the right map. It's showing me the harbor map. Okay. I think my map is broken now. Yeah, it just really wants to show me the Harper map. Oh, Red Rose. I haven't found that in forever, it feels like. I'll look at that in some other episode, though. Right now, I'm, I have a single-minded focus. Blacksmith. Still the Harper. Pirate attire seems to have survived pretty well. I'm surprised I can't take any of it. Ooh, is that them? Hmm. It's a 
beached ship over there. I wonder if I can get to it. I don't know why I bother looking at the map. I think there's a pathway to it. Is this where the blacksmith is? The further I go, the more I doubt myself. I don't know, because I swear they said, like, meet me at the shore, but then I think the quest is meet them at the cliffs. So, like, eh, yeah, maybe. Why do I feel like these are going to rise up from the dead and become, like, reanimated or something. It really feels like it. I mean, not like right now, but like some sort of a story event will happen that will make them rise from the dead. Perhaps the green flame will come back or something. I strongly suspect so. Maybe we'll have to board this ship. There is a boat here. Yeah, it feels like some sort of a story kind of thing I need to come back to at some point. Prisons. Whoa. So I think this is an unlimited pile. Yeah. Oh. Oh, that's an explosion meter building up, so you can't go too far, huh? And it looks like it doesn't go back down. Interesting. Well, let's try to set one of these off and just see what it looks like. I hope it actually makes a noise. So I think we just strike it with this, right? And then run. That <laughs> blew up really fast. Yeah, actually makes a noise. Cool. Don't think there's anything I can do with it right now. Like, there's nothing that seems to need blowing up. So it probably is for these enemies. Okay, I feel totally lost. Like, am I supposed to meet the blacksmith somewhere here or not? Uh, I've broken the map, so that's no help at all, even though I do have a map of the shore. I just feel like totally lost and confused right now. So that whole area back there, I'm definitely not meant to do anything there yet. That's pretty obvious. This really doesn't feel like where the blacksmith would be. I saw that gold nugget shining in the light. Here's another rose. Oh. No, this is not where I started. Uh, I don't have any explosives to throw, do I? I don't suppose this would work? No. Need a pine cone. Dang it. Yeah, I can't go in there. It'll just either kill me or, like, take me down to one hit point. Oh, here's another rose. I've almost got all of them. 14 out of 17. Okay, well, I managed to get back to this Harper Bridge here. Um, I think I'm going to end this episode here. I am lost and confused, so <laughs> I need to uh, gather my thoughts and come back later when I'm a bit more collected. So I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, um, I don't think we're going to go back to the shore, because it seemed like absolutely nobody and nothing was there. Maybe it was the wrong time of day, I have no idea, but I think I'll explore the harbor a bit more and probably try to get back to the blacksmith, assuming that they're actually back there at their original place and not at the shore or the cliffs or wherever they're supposed to be and i'll be back soon